Hello guys, welcome back to the playroom and thank you guys so much for joining me today on yet another doll unboxing or doll haul. I actually have several to share with you guys today. These are going to be all handmade dolls that I found on Etsy from this amazing seller. She is so, so sweet. So I'm super excited to get into this box opening and share these dolls with you guys. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and get on with the show. Hello doll friends, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day today or night if it's nighttime where you guys are. But I'm back at you guys with several dolls to share with you guys. They all came in at once from this amazingly sweet seller. Her name is Natalia. I found her on Etsy. She is so sweet. Um, and these are gonna be Amigurumi dolls. It's a Japanese word. Amigurumi means crocheting or knitting. Um, it's the art of crocheting. So these are all handmade crochet dolls, you guys. I'm super excited to share these with you. We're gonna go ahead and just dive right in. I'm gonna go ahead and start with the, we'll just start with the box on top. So let me move the other boxes out of the way and get into that one and I'll be right back. Okay guys, I'm back with the white box in front of me and we're just gonna go ahead and cut this right open. I think we can make this pretty quick. Okay guys, we are into our first box and our first doll is so cute. Oh my goodness, she is bigger than I thought she was gonna be. She is pretty. Let me get her out of this plastic, guys. Okay guys, I got her out of the plastic. Are you guys ready to take a look at our beautiful Isabella? I actually remember this one's name. I don't remember the other ones, but I do remember this one specifically because she was so detailed. So guys, this is our beautiful Isabella. That's what she was listed as in the shop. And I'm gonna leave you guys a link to the seller shop in the description box below. Um, Natalia is super sweet, so make sure and check her out if you're interested. You guys, I love Isabella. She is absolutely adorable. I want to say she's 37 centimeters, which is about 14 inches, if I remember correctly. I love her headband. This is all crocheted. Oh, this is made by hand. And look at all of that beautiful beadwork. So every flower has like a little bead or stone. That is so pretty. Look at her hair. Her hair is amazing. I'm in love with her hair. Her hair is so pretty. And it's long. She is pretty. This is um, a wired doll. So she actually has a wire inside of her so she can actually be posed. And she is gorgeous. I love her outfit. Look at her beaded necklace, you guys. She has on a beautiful beaded necklace. There are her beautiful stitched eyebrows. We have the stitching around the eyes. I love her eyes. I think, they're, I think those are just so, so pretty. She's got her little mouth there. She's got a little bit of blush. I love the dress. I love the aqua with the peach. And this is kind of, it's, it's kind of pink, but it's more of a, a salmon color. I would call this a salmon color, actually. I love the yellow in the middle. I just think the dress is so pretty. And look at the bottom. You guys, all that beadwork in the dress. And that, it looks like that has to be done while it's being crocheted. I'm not sure how she did all that. It's so pretty. And it goes around the whole dress. Look at that, you guys. Wow. That is so intricate. It's so pretty. Here are her shoes. She has these beautiful shoes that tie all the way up, halfway up her leg. I love the little flower detail and there's another stone there. Wow, she is gorgeous. She is so pretty. You guys, she is a beautiful doll. I'm gonna back up a little bit. She's, I think she can stand on her own. She may need a little bit of help. And there she is, you guys. I think she was absolutely stunning. I love her colors of the dress. The dress is just so pretty. I love all the different colors, the aquas, the yellows, the salmon color, pink, pink salmon. And then we also have this really pretty deep red at the very bottom. Um, they just all work together really well. I think she is so pretty. I'm in love with her. What do you guys think of Isabella? I love Isabella. So that's our first doll up. So definitely not disappointed. Let's go ahead and get on to our next box. 
Okay guys, we have our next box in front of us and we're gonna just dive right in again. And I may speed this up a little bit. Okay guys, we are into our next box and this is our next doll, which is going to be more of a floppy doll. Um, let me get her out of this plastic bag, guys, and I'll be right back. Okay guys, are you guys ready to see our next doll? I am in love with her too, she's so pretty. Okay, here she is, you guys. Here is our next girl. She is so cute. I'm loving her outfit. Now, she is a floppy doll. So, unlike Isabella, she just kind of flops. So, she has that joint there at her knee. I love kind of how that joint works. That is so cool. I love how her knee bends. I love the shoes. Oh, look at the little button detail. We've got the white there all around the bottom of the red shoe. I love the red shoes. I love her outfit. She has on this cute red, white, and green accented outfit. She looks like strawberries, so I think I'm just gonna make her my strawberry girl. I love the hat. We have an alternating red and white hat, and then we have this beautiful flower detail right here on the side, which I think is absolutely adorable. I love her arm. She's so pretty. I love that she just she's kind of just floppy and she just kind of does her thing. She is so cute. Let's set her down and see if we can get her a good pose. And there she is, you guys. I think she's absolutely adorable. She's definitely going to be my little strawberry girl. I'm going to get a little strawberry crocheted strawberry and put right in the middle of her dress and just make her my strawberry doll. I think she's adorable. I love her features. I'm going to give you guys one last close up of her face because I just think her face is so pretty. She's got the little stitched eyebrows up there. Her eyes are gorgeous. I love all that stitching detail. So she's got stitched eyelashes and we have the little white around her eyes. She's got a little stitched nose there and of course her little stitched mouth. I love, I love her face. I think she is so cute. She has such a cute, adorable, expressive face. I just think she's absolutely adorable. So that's our little strawberry girl. Let's go ahead and put her aside. We're going to take a look at all the dolls again at the end of the video, but let's go ahead and get on to our next box. Okay, friends, I'm back at you with our last box of the day, and this is a little bit bigger, so this may have two dolls in it, possibly, maybe. I'll go ahead and speed this up as well. And yes, guys, there was definitely two dolls in that box. So let's go ahead and get out our first doll. I love, love, love this color. I love the aqua. And she has a little elephant with her. I just thought she was so pretty. I thought she was so pretty. Let's go ahead and get her out. And let's go ahead and get out our other doll while we're at it. Now this one is going to be another wire doll that can stand. And she is cute. Okay, guys. Let me get these dolls out of the plastic bags. I'll be right back. Okay, doll friends, I'm back with our first doll and here she is. I just think she is so cute. This is her, I love her face. I put her hair up in these two little ponytails because that's how it was in the promo picture and I just thought it was so cute like that. I love her little blue and white dress. So we have white, we have kind of a pale, medium, light blue and then we have a darker navy blue. And all of this is actually embedded with this beautiful silver, silver stitching within the, um, the crocheted yarn. I think that is so pretty. She has underwear. The underwear is crocheted. I think that is so cute. So I'm loving that she has underwear and it's really cute on top of that. And then here are her little white shoes. We have the white shoes with the same navy blue at the bottom. And then we've got a little navy blue button there. I just think this doll is so pretty. And look at this hair, you guys. Look at all that hair. Can you imagine how long that took to crochet all that hair? So this entire doll is crocheted. And then she has the little stitched eyebrows. She has her little glass eyes with the white stitching underneath and her sweet little stitched eyelashes that go all the way to the corner there. We've got a little stitched nose and then we have her little stitch mouth right there. And I love her expression. I just think she kind of has a little sad expression but at the same time, she's so sweet. I'll go ahead and stand her up and we'll take a better look at her really quick. Okay, you guys, and there she is. I think she is absolutely adorable. I'm loving the ponytails. I definitely think I want to leave her hair in the ponytails. I just think they're so cute. 
I love her sweet expressive face. I love her little blue dress. She's just absolutely adorable. I think she is beautiful. Natalia really did a great job on this doll. I love all of them so far. So let's go ahead and take a look at our last doll for the day. Okay, doll friends, last but not least, we have our last doll of the day, which is also gonna be our biggest doll. I think the rest of these dolls are around 15 inches. This doll is huge. You guys, this doll is probably, I would say around 17 inches. She's chunky, she is so pretty. So here she is, you guys. I love this doll. I love her, I love her, I love her. I love her chocolatey brown hair. Look at all of that hair. She has a ton, ton, ton of hair. She has these beautiful little hair bows or hair ties, which I think are so pretty. And they're beaded, which I think is absolutely adorable. She has these beautifully stitched eyebrows, again, with the beautiful glass eyes, that beautiful eyelash stitching there. I love her eyelash work on these dolls. Just so pretty. Natalia is just so talented. I love her beautifully stitched nose. She's got a cute little pink mouth there, rosy cheeks. She's got diamond earrings, which I think are adorable. I love the dress. I think the dress is so pretty. I love that aqua blue color with the white. I think it's just absolutely adorable. She has these beautiful little white shoes and they have little pink hearts in them and they have pink stitching around them. I didn't even notice that in the photos, but she makes all of these to order. She made all of these for me. Um, which is amazing. She's such a she's such a talented artist. I love this doll and She comes with her little elephant Look at this elephant you guys. I think this elephant is absolutely adorable Look at that face. The elephant has a little pink bow right there at the top All the stitch work and this is all crocheted all this is made by hand So so cute you guys. I'm actually gonna set her down. Let's take a quick look at her. Here she is sitting down, posed perfectly. I think she's amazing. I love the fact that these are jointed, that these have the little joints and you can kind of move their hand or their knee or their leg in a certain position. It is, they're just so cute. I love the wired ones too though. I love the fact they can stand, but you can also stand these with the doll stand. So if you put a doll stand underneath her, you can actually have her stand up as well. But I love these dolls. This one is just so pretty. You guys, this one is so beautiful. I love the colors. I love that aqua blue. I think it's just so striking. Let's go ahead and get all of our dolls out, guys, and take one last look. I'll be right back. Okay, doll friends, as promised, here are all of our dolls that we got for today. There is beautiful Isabella. There is our beautiful little blue aqua girl with the brown hair and the elephant, which I love. That's what I call my strawberry girl. And I love that her hand can actually fit inside the pocket of her dress, I think that's so adorable. And then I call this one the little ponytail girl because she's, I gave her ponytails. I just think they're so, so pretty. They're so well made. The quality is amazing. A big shout out to Natalia for making all of these for me. Um, the name of her shop is Toys by Merrill. I'm gonna put that right here. This is the name of her shop. Toys by Merrill. She is a star seller on Etsy. I can see why. She doesn't only make these crochet dolls though. She also makes oak dolls. She makes Waldorf dolls. She does custom dolls. She makes crochet animals. Her animals are amazing. They're so pretty. Um, did I say Waldorf? She does make Waldorf dolls. Um, she is so talented. I think she even has a silicone doll on, the, on, her, on her shop right now. Anyway, super talented seller. I would highly recommend her if you guys are interested in any of these. I, a big shout out to her and a big thanks to her for making these beautiful dolls. She did it in record time. They're amazing. So a big shout out to her. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think of the dolls, of the crochet dolls. I would love to know your thoughts. Do you have any? Are you interested in them? I would love to know your thoughts. Guys, thank you so much for being a part of my channel. I love you guys to the moon and back. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe for more fun dolly content. Stay safe, be kind, and I will see you guys on my next video. Bye guys.